My name's Kaylee. And I'm Josiane, and our business is Educalm. So I was fully immersed in French, mostly for the first couple years of my life. As I grew older, I started learning English. At home, it was all about keeping the language so that we wouldn't lose it. My parents chose to send me to immersion school. I think it has a lot to do with the fact that my mom didn't have the chance to go to immersion. My grandma um, is Francophone and my mom's grandparents only spoke French. Well, I think my mom really wanted to give me the chance that she didn't get to have, which was to learn the second language that was part of our family's heritage, but really kind of got lost. Because I saw that it was important to them, it felt important to me as well. We met at the University of St. Boniface in education. When we started teaching, we saw really quickly that there was something missing in schools, and that was support for students in their social emotional learning. We both started practicing mindfulness in our own lives and saw that it really helped us to um, balance our lives and feel calmer, more joyful. So we wanted to share this with our students. There was no program that existed that was made for schools and was bilingual. So in our search to, to find the program that didn't exist, we decided that we would make it ourselves. <laughs> Educom is an online program. It's called Educom Classroom, École Educale, and it's completely bilingual. So teachers subscribe and they get access to both the practices in English and in French. So the way that it works is that there are audio guided mindfulness practices that are five minutes long. They just have to press play and they get to learn and practice along with their students. Bienvenue à Educan, commençons notre pratique. There just aren't as many resources available to francophones or French speaking people. So the fact that we can serve that population um, and serve them well is really important to us it probably doubles our client base. <laughs> Just the fact that we can be in French, French immersion and English schools. One day it would be great to add other languages to that because we could translate this in Spanish or in Italian or who knows, you know, there's so many options. It could be all over the world maybe, I don't know.